I'm Emily Kopp. I'm the Director of Religious Education at St. Joseph Parish Imperial. And I've been here about uh, a little over a year, since June of 2022. I was born and raised here in St. Louis, grew up in South County in the Afton area. So not too far, just a little north on 55. I'm the third of four girls. So there were a lot of ladies in the house. People always said my dad was blessed among women. And I, I enjoyed getting to have so many sisters around. We had a lot of fun together. I went to Rosati down in the city uh, and then went to Rockhurst for my undergrad and ended up at St. Meinrad in Indiana for my graduate degree. I've been involved at different parishes and schools and one thing I noticed right away at St. Joseph is the variety of ages at all sorts of events, whether it's encounter and you have little tiny babies up to men and women in their late 70s or maybe even older and everyone's just like milling about and chatting with one another. One thing I find helpful is just starting my day in prayer, whether it's just a quick, okay, Jesus, like today is yours, or the longer period of time of prayer. And trying to even do that before I pick up my phone or get out of bed, but to make that the first thing I do. And also throughout the day, just having touch points with the Lord, whether that's at lunch, just quickly being like, okay, how is the day going? Um, there have been seasons where I've set alarms throughout the day to be like, okay, like it's time to get up and pray or go do this. I can't just tell Jesus the day is his at the beginning of the day and do nothing about it the rest of the day, that I have to continue to say yes and to choose him in every moment. Uh, and then also to ask for forgiveness when I don't do that. I think that's also important and not to beat myself up too much about that, but to be like, okay, uh, I have forgotten you, Jesus, but I'm coming back and choosing you again today in this moment and also just asking for his grace to recall him. My drink of choice most days is just a hot cup of coffee with like a spoonful of sugar and some creamer. I really love like French vanilla creamer, something that has a little flavor to it. Every now and again, I switch and drink a cup of just straight black tea. One thing that's been inspiring me lately is uh, actually listening to Father Rizika's homilies during the school masses. Last week he was talking so much about offering our hearts to Jesus and just being a friend of Christ and especially to each day to ask Jesus, how is it that you look upon me? And that way we can find our identity rooted there rather than in what other people are saying or thinking, but to really keep ourselves rooted in what Jesus thinks of us and how that's the primary identity that we need to carry with us throughout the day. I love having my eggs with breakfast uh, over easy with some nice like crispy toast to go with it. You can dunk it in there. Um, salt, pepper, delish. Moving forward, one thing I am really hoping to do here at St. Joseph is to find the groups that we're not yet reaching. One group that's been on my heart and mind a lot in recent months has been families. Families of all ages, not just little kids, but also families with high schoolers. And how can we bring families together? Yes, for prayer, but also just for fun activities. And so that's something that I desire to grow here at St. Joseph. Um, but also just to become more aware of the populations that we're missing. Who are we not yet reaching? And how can we best do that? So if you have ideas, or know of people, groups that are underserved, please let me know and also be assured of our prayers for you as you continue your journey with Christ.